Jake, thanks for having us in your home today. You really don't have to travel very far to the club, do you? No, nah, it's been really good living close to the club. It's just, um, it's almost walking distance, so it's really good. So many first year players choose to live with a host family when they move from interstate, but you've chosen to live with a housemate. So I was with um, Riley O'Brien to start off with, and um, yeah, and he was really good over pre-season, helping me and guiding me in the right direction. And then, yeah, just wanted to have a bit more fun and enjoy it a bit more with Luke and yeah, I'm just loving it at the moment, it's good. And how's the housemate relationship going, given that you spend time at the club together, come home, you're at home together, do you get on each other's nerves? Nah, not at all, it's been really good at the moment. Um, maybe when we're playing FIFA and 2K and all that, <laughs> but some stuff gets smashed, like controllers and all that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I did see, when I walked in the front door, there were shoes, a lot of shoes lined up perfectly. Now you said majority of them were Luke's. Luke put them there to start off with and they're mostly his, I only have about two pairs but I actually really like it, it brings a bit of um, uniqueness to the house. So I agree, cool. yeah. I agree, I like <laughs> it. Down to the danger zone, Patton, little slip from Marshall, that's enough! They'll be screaming his name if he kicks his first, Lego, not a dirty word in the Adelaide Oval. Seven matches under your belt now, how do you think your first season of AFL footy is going? Yeah, I'm just really enjoying it to be honest, I was pretty honoured to debut in round one and then um, yeah, went back and played some sand for footy and got back into the team and feel like I'm playing a bit more consistent footy now, which is good. You're a bit of a running machine. What's your secret? Oh, I'm not too sure. I haven't always been a good runner, but I've been um, definitely a massive work on for me over the years. And yeah, and I've just been pushing myself really hard in the pre-seasons. Salino's courage was needed. You re-signed at the beginning of the year without even playing your first AFL game. You must have settled in well at the club. Yeah, I was super stoked when they um, when they wanted to sign me on. I was actually over the moon. So um, all the boys have been really welcoming, even when you first get drafted. And do you feel like you're now really a big part of this club? Yeah, 100%. I'm just keen to see us all improve and can't wait to see where we end up. Thanks, Lego. 